In Algeria, we have a facility with a, a, a project with our partner to make a facility there. So for Namibia as well, it's been on our mind for a very long time. With a growing dates industry, Namibia exports hundreds of tons of dates to Europe, Asia and the Middle East. And Minister Ipumbu says the country has established itself as a quality dates producer and hopes to expand production. This is the purpose why we are here. First and foremost, to look at the possibilities of us exporting the surplus of our dates to you. Barak would be better with the Namibian dates if we, uh, we were to enter into an agreement of us uh, exporting some of our dates to here. However, the critical component that I want us to engage going forward is us putting up some facilities in terms of processing those dates locally. She took note of the impressive range of byproducts produced by Al Baraka and hopes for a similar endeavor for Namibia. Apart from the unique and complementary harvest season that takes place between November and March, the minister further highlighted Namibia's positioning as a favorable trade route. Al Baraka currently exports to 53 countries. I wouldn't want you to export your products to Namibia. But I want Namibia to assist you to add on the list of the countries that are to export as, as, as teams, as partners, so that we also reach out to the outside market together with you. Established in 1988, Al Baraka Dates is a market leader for packaged and processed dates in the Middle East. We had a very fruitful discussion on uh, ways of uh, expanding our business in Namibia by using the great resources available in uh, Namibia. And uh, it, uh, it definitely looks like we will, def we will be, uh, lo we, we look forward to uh, setting up uh, a future business there.